Now you all have one of these in your goodie bags. You do, in case you need one. And if you need, if you don't have one here, you can borrow mine. Just figure. All right. Get the whole roll. Now, I need to tell the. I need to. I need. You know what, sweetheart? I got to tell you that first song you played. It's a little off key. By the way, it was sweet. It was sweet. But you should have had me singing, because you know I'm a professional. I could have come out here and sang Valore for you. You like Valore? Valore. All right, see you. Good, good, good. Here we go. And you know what? If you had responded, I'd have continued. I'd have sang the whole damn song. And you'd have loved it. You'd be crying and shit. Okay. Enough of that. All right, here we go. Now, if you are like me, you're wondering what the hell is up with all of this trash hanging around this uh, canopy here. Well, it's tradition for the bride and groom to fold 1,000 origami cranes before their wedding. And of course, them being who they are, you don't get cranes. You get skulls. Yeah. Yeah. Skulls, which they tell me signifies uh, transition, uh, the infinite, the, 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 the what else? Infinite. The, the infinite, the eternal, yeah. something really nice like that. Yeah. Now they say that cranes made for life and that skulls made for death. <laughs> so you got, you got to give them credit for covering all their bases. You know? So here we are. Oh, and I want to remind you that inside your bag, you got one of these. So you can keep them as a nice, happy memento of the occasion. Or you can throw them in a the trash can. I don't give a rat's ass. <laughs> now, if you know Ramona at all, and I'm sure that many of you do, you'll realize that she is nobody's property. So giving her away is really not an option. <laughs> but then, you go, somebody's applause. <laughs> Oh! Hey, listen, maybe. <laughs> he ain't doing any of the ringing until I give you the cue to do the ringing. Why did you bell? I didn't say nothing about no bells. <laughs> For crying out loud. Okay, but it, we don't have, we don't need to give her away because Ben's family has already graciously welcomed her into their life. And that's perfect because she's just as fucking nuts as they are. <laughs> True that. Now. True that. Would anyone from that side of the family, that's Ben's side, like to say something about the happy couple? Yep, that's oh, you're standing up. Well, you must be somebody important. Are you somebody important? You well, I'm Ben's papa. Oh, oh. so that's right. Come on up here. Hey, 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 don't. Oh, don't oh. <laughs> and if the floor is not, the ground is not straight. The floor? <laughs> the flock already? Just read what you wrote down. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. All right. Well, I've been married three times. Well, and they say three times the friggin' charm. <laughs> and it is. I'm here with my uh, lovely wife, Karen. Yay! Who helped me raise Benjamin. Oh, Thank you. <laughs> so she is partially responsible. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's right. And Ben and Ramona are ending their second marriage. <coughs> but they're both fat shit. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but that should make it work. <laughs> Ramona asked me to stand up here because uh, both her parents have passed. And, well, I'm just window dressing. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, uh, take her, my man. <laughs> <laughs> but I'd like to quote oh. Lucy from Shakespeare. And that's, uh, that's Ben's thing. Actually, this is very loosely, but to be or not to be, the course of true love never did run smooth. And if wit be the food of love, then play on, leading players. <laughs> Hold on. I'm supposed to do this. <laughs> <laughs> that's a cute. That's very well. <laughs> Well, let me finish this screwed up friggin' speech by saying, better to be witty than a fool than a foolish wit. <laughs> and in conclusion, um, Karen and I wish you long life 
and many batshit crazy times together. <laughs> That's beautiful. Where's your arm? Where's your arm? Let's give him a round of applause. Beautiful. Good, good. Who else now? How about Lara? Back here. Back here. Well, get your ass up here. What the fuck you doing? <laughs> Jesus Christ, you think you got all day? Hey. There you oh, she's crying. It's gonna it's start. Okay. Yep. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. That's good. You're in good company. All right. So, um, about a month ago. Ben asked me to stand in for my mom. And just so you guys know, she passed away less than a year ago. So that's still really hard. But but I was really pissed at him. <laughs> because when he asked me, he said, well, since mom's gone, you are now the matriarch of the <laughs> So even though I dye my hair, yes, I am fully gray. And thanks a lot for making me feel really freaking old. <laughs> but they blossom when we love the ones we marry. Um, Ramona, you're joining our family, and uh, we want to help you and Ben. So I'm speaking for Isaac, our brother, and um, um, my that husband, guy. Bob. <laughs> and then Ethan. <laughs> um, that's our son. And um, uh, we want to um, help you and Ben your love for each other and help it blossom and grow. Um, and I hope we can do that. Just know that there's going to be days of sunshine and then there's going to be days of rain, um, as well as changes of seasons in your life. And it's going to happen. Um, but you're now part of the beautiful garden that's our family. And um, we're going to be there to support you. And I have another quote. Marriage isn't a noun. It's a verb. Um, it isn't something you get. It's something that you do. And it's the way you love your partner every day. And our family's so glad that you found each other to love. Um, our hearts are bursting for you today. Um, you care for each other, and you complement each other's strengths and weaknesses. Um, yeah. You're best friends for life, and we couldn't be happier for you both. So, Gosh. Love you guys. That was beautiful. Damn. Yep. You were in the house. Starting early. Now, would, any, <laughs> would anybody else like to say anything to the happy couple? This is your opportunity to say something. Hopefully not too obscene. Anybody. Wow. <laughs> not just family. Y'all two fuckers. <laughs> <laughs> I met y'all at a crazy ass time in my life. Yeah. And the two of you welcomed me with open ass arms and open ass hearts and loved me for who I was. And the only thing I could do was do the same. And I love you guys so, so much. You guys are always, always going to be family to me. And I'm so glad I got to meet you too. Thank you. You're wonderful. Thank you. That's beautiful. Watch out, watch out, watch out! Oh, I'm scared for the oh, drama, okay? <laughs> this is not a lie. This is not a lie. <laughs> Would anyone else care to say something to the bride and groom? Oh! It's a little late outfit. Uh huh. I love that. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hello. 
I'm John Eustace. Yeah, right. Oh, I didn't recognize you with the mask on. <laughs> I've known Ramona on Facebook for several years. And when she announced that she was getting married and I got an invitation, I was thrilled. So I drove from Delaware to meet Ramona and Ben because they are absolutely exceptional people and we're all lucky to have them. And now's when he gives them a new car! Anyone else? Would anyone else care to say something to the happy couple? Come on, guys, represent. <laughs> is Wonder Woman? Not no, 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 no. This is the impromptu moment. So if you just happen to have something that you want to Some say. Random shit. Random shit. Random shit. Merchant Chiefs all the damn time. Woo! Couple of them, anyway. All right. Very quickly, Very quickly. I just want to say thank you for sharing your authenticity of love because people have, have marriages and relationships, but you guys are the real deal of what love can shine through working together. And your yin and yang is just so beautiful. And if everybody in this place, we all love each other just because of your connection and your spirit. So thank you for bringing us through your light and thank, keep shining on. I can't wait to celebrate your 10 year anniversary. Your yin and your yang. We got some yang and some you yang. Got, they got their yings and they <laughs> got their yangs all over. the yang. You got the yang? <laughs> right. Anybody the else? Yang. Yes. Uh, Here we go. That's uh, uh, <gasps> Oh, my God. You're going to speak? Yeah, I'm going to speak. What the hell? So I'm the one that didn't say anything last night. So, <laughs> but I have gotten kicked out of a restaurant for wearing this shirt. So, um, I got to do that the last time. So I'm glad I didn't get to do it this time. Because yeah. <laughs> once is enough. <laughs> but, um, no, all I wanted to say is... is you know, you two meet, have met each other, known each other for a little bit, spent some, a little bit of time around you. You look very happy together. I have no idea where you're going, but I think that's what makes you two special is that you figure it out on the way and have fun. So all I have to say is enjoy the ride, make the most of it.